got a call last night saying the bluefin are on at Hokitika. There's a window window. And <coughs> we're off. Yo! A bit of a recap on that rushed uh, video at the start. Uh, Clint, good mate of mine, uh, rung up last night saying there's a weather window at Okatika uh, for bluefin. I've been catching some good fish out of there, 150, well, 100 to 150 kilo, and obviously the Pacific ones are out there as well, which are pretty big. I've never caught one, haven't seen one, but um, excited as I've been living down in South Island for two years, coming up three. Haven't been out fishing since, apart from trout fishing, and um, man, I'm excited as. Hey, the waka! <laughs> We're just uh, picking up some salt ice. That Clint's organised. Got enough there, mate? Fucking body bag. Our last soldier just arrived. What do we have? 24 cans. Oh. It's all happening. It's breakfast time. It's uh, Saturday 29th and we're in Greymouth. Woo! She's blowing a bit though. Boat's already gone out in the dark. We're just cooking some breakfast. Blah, blah, blah. Right, just see our drags. Greymouth Harbour. Chucking the fuel up the boat. Set all the drags. A little bit of small care for the overnight trip. Blue is all set. Just gonna maybe rig up another one just in case. And we found the uh, found the factory ships. About oh, two metres well. Another couple of factory ships over there. Where you see them. There you go. Oh, how good is this? I've been wanting to do this for like years, years and years. And uh, finally getting the opportunity to try and target a blooper. Pretty cool. So we're in the vicinity now. We're just going to be telling loops here, right? We're in the game! Exciting times. Give me some size comparison. Boat's massive. Oh, we've picked the weather window. It is flat. Oh, caught some bait for tonight and a bit of fresh fish. I don't know what they call these, but they look like Grand Eddie Arpa to me. Beautiful eating. And a few berries for some sword baits and some poker baits. Oh, we've just done some drops, got some fish, and back on the trawl. Uh, trying to save some gas to be fair. Uh, this boat, they're doing a beat from pretty much this point here and we're boat is way in the far distance so we're just waiting for them to pretty much come up here, pull nets and see if we can't um, snag a bluefin when they're pulling up the nets which is apparently how they have been successful in the past so yeah. Well we've had no success.
Oh, we've just talked to a couple of boys and um, they hooked up. Uh, they landed one out of two and um, they said that we're in the right area. So we're going to give it a good nudge for another couple of hours out here. Hooked on to something good. It's me. That's a good line angle. I can't get anything to back now. He can keep going around if he wants. Try and get his line back. The mongrel will come out of here. Three starboard. Yeah. That's starboard. I would like to get some fucking line back. Come on, man. Use those legs. Yep. Legs set like a little sticky. They always are when they're hot. And so if you don't move them, there's a little bit more drag there than if they're playing you like that. Yeah, I'd say when you get to see that leader, mate, it's going to go, you know. Yeah. You're only going to walk with like 140 kilo fish, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so we just lost that fish at two hours, well, just under two hours, but didn't do anything different, didn't touch drag, didn't do anything, and everything just as good as gold. But yeah. I guess just playing a fish for two hours and just circling. It's all steel trace. Got, got hit by a dolphin, got hit by a bird. Our setup, I can see it, but like, I think we hooked up somewhere over here and we probably did a million circles on that big fat bit oh there you go look at that that is a good set of circles well two hours of circles <laughs> oh so i just had a nerd nap for me and tim actually after the fight and um woke up five three hours later Boy. Skipper still been skipper. Three hours of trawling. Angler jumped on a rod and just oh, real screaming. Oh, we're setting it in for the battle. Does it feel good being hooked up? Oh, and not driving? What's that? Is there a knot in that line? Is there? <laughs> it's the same fucking reel up there. <laughs> it is the same reel. Nah, it's not. Nah, nah. We, what are you up to, bro? Are you still half asleep? Yeah, you were you were putting your right arm into your left arm. Our fish has gone surface. He is probably an hour into a fight now, so he's doing well. And we've got a beautiful pot of dolphins on coming around with us, but they are touching, touching the line, so. Nice. Do you reckon this fish is getting, like, help? Oh, fuck off, birds, help. you dogs. I just got a seagull to the, uh, line. <laughs> All right, so we finally got a southern. That's the nice holder. Keep some water on the skills. I didn't, bud. Night fishing. I was on the gaff. Uh, stuck the life jacket on. Got my POB on. Just in case, man. It's strong. Very strong. Just heaven, bud. Oh, just caught this. It was not like a little bit of mixed emotions, I see. Yeah, big beautiful fish, unbelievable. We've been going all day and had no hookups until tonight, actually. Um, oh, the barracuda slag caught some barracuda. I caught some barracuda. This guy caught some perch. Some perch. <laughs> Three on yeah, one drop, boy. though. Yeah, it's successful. Weighs yeah. almost as much as this. And I would hate to see what your fish look like. Yeah, we had one on for that, that two was an hours. Hour and yours was two hours and 15 minutes. Every rock on the boat's like, fuck. 
Are you being soft? Yeah. That's good. What a beautiful fish. At 1.68 meters long. Through there, like that, on yeah. the angle. Okay. Oh, heads off, guts is out in the bag, and a 70 litre of ice attack plus 20 kilos of ice. Looking after our fish beautifully. Of course, I had to steal a bit for some sashimi. Just running two rods at night. Um, so we've just, we've actually successfully landed that other fish. Oh shit. And um, so yeah, it's pretty cool. Pretty cool to see that. So we've sort of now thought, man, it's pretty hard to land our fish. So just sitting, just sitting two rods pretty much and daisy chains um, at night so we can actually see what's going on and play the fish. So. Tag and release now. And this is what I come bluefin tuna fishing for. So it's 3.30 in the morning. Moon's out, beautiful. Won't be able to see him, but we just found another Lu lure, uh, Lumo lure in the collection. And our sounder is just crazy with sign. Um, it's just gonna work this area now. Man, this is exciting stuff. <laughs> 3 30 in the morning though. I think I missed the sunrise. Must have slept in. These boys didn't. We've still been towing lures. We're good to go. Just come across a couple of boats and the sunrise over there. With a boat hooked up. Sick. Yes. On again. Sun's rising. He's catching us breakfast. Our fourth hookup. Top shot coming back. 30 meters. Doing a good job at like 36 minutes. We are 15 meters off our fish for the fourth time. Nice work, nice work. Mm, 50 minutes in. Yeah, boy. All right, so we've sort of come to a conclusion that if we can tag this fish, we're gonna give it a good nudge. Man, these fish fight hard. Next on Helm again. Work. It is, it is. Got a big fish again. We're on around 15 kilos of drag. An hour and a half? Yeah. We've seen it a few times and it's been just under the boat. So there's a double plat out there. Now did you lubricate that with WD-40 before you tightened it? Oh, that's a wrap. We lost number four fish. Got yeah. to the boat, put it on the leader, so. Win some, lose most. Yeah, that's called a tag and release without a tag. Oh, sorry, yeah, we let it go. There's a video coming of us letting it go. It goes something like. <laughs> oh, pretty cool. We'll be back. Going back into Greymouth Bar. Oh, back in grey mouth. Learned so much. 
so much information and just a lot more respect for these crochet. Pretty good cool fish. And the cleanup's begun. It's 10 o'clock this morning, all the boys rocked up. He's going down starboard, under. Starboard, starboard. Oh, yeah. Round the back of the motor. Oh, that's a big fish. Oh, 